Hey, this is Chuck at that Rhythm Man Guitars. This is a uh, 1940 Epiphone Emperor. You may have seen it in some of the other videos hanging on the wall behind me. We've actually had this one for a few months, but I did not want to put it out there available for sale until we found a case for it. It didn't have a case, and as you might imagine, finding a case for a guitar that's almost 18 and a half inches wide and has this long headstock on top of that is not an easy task, but we were fortunate enough to get one and it's an error correct one nonetheless. Um, so this guitar is one that um, is very impressive in a lot of ways. It actually was retopped, I believe, almost assuredly by Epiphone in the 1950s. Has a was relabeled with its original 1940 serial number, but it has a blue inked label rather than a green inked label showing that it was definitely at the labels later than 1940. The guitar doesn't have any cracks in the top at all. It has a really nice carved arch on here. Really um, nice recurve and everything. The guitar does have a um, center seam separation which has been glued and then it has some refinish work done because it was rebound at that same time. These guitars were Epiphones were kind of notorious through some of this period. 1940 was certainly within that era when they had binding that just didn't last very long. But it was rebound, had some finish work done there, an overspray over the whole guitar. Pretty light, you can see it um, was worn through the original finish here, but the finish that went on, back on it is just enough to kind of cover it. Definitely not any of that heavy stuff that you sometimes see somebody do. But this guitar exemplifies exactly what an emperor is supposed to do. This guitar is big, bold, and it punches hard. It doesn't have as much sustain as some other guitars, but if you're looking for one that can do the accompaniment work that these guitars were originally being made to do, this one fits the bill big time. It does, um, of course you heard a little bit at the beginning, but I mean if you want to hit there and sit there and go... <laughs> Just hitting those things where you're just like, you know, two, three notes. I mean, you could definitely get away with the single note stuff. It hits hard in the mid range, especially. Just what you think of. This is, in that regard, definitely ex an exceptional guitar. bodied guitar but it's kind of a specialized guitar overall even though it is a lot of fun to play just doing solo stuff it um it really shines doing the rhythm work you can check this guitar out at that rhythmman.com and we look forward to hearing from you and check our other videos out and if you like to see especially a lot of these old arch tops but a lot of other guitars too. Sign up and uh, subscribe and you'll see us keep putting videos out. Thanks. <laughs> this thing makes every guitar in here ring.